Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. The latest stable version of the Google Chrome web browser, Google Chrome version 91, is now rolling out. It started rolling out on the 25th of May 2021. So this takes us from version 90 to 91 in this latest stable release of the Google Chrome web browser. Now, in Google Chrome 91, there's really not too much you know, in the line of features, so it's very small in that department, version 91, but it is mainly a security feature update that has rolled out with version 91. Now, as always, if you'd like to see if you have the latest version, just head over to your top right to the three-dotted menu, Help, About Chrome, and if you use Chrome as your main web browser and on a regular basis, this process will update automatically in the back background. It will take place automatically in the background. But just to double check, the latest version and build that you should be on is version 91.0.4472.77. Now, as mentioned, you know, there's not uh, too many features, but there are 32 security vulnerabilities that have been patched and fixed in this latest version of Google Chrome, version 91. And if we just head over to the Chrome releases uh, web page, we can see uh, the stable channel update for desktop. It rolled out May the 25th. And here's the latest version and build. And here we can see security fixes. This update includes 32 security fixes. So that is always good to know. And you know, if you're not really interested in any features, uh, you know, you know, new features in Google Chrome, just updating for the security benefits and the vulnerabilities that have been fixed um, is a good idea just to make sure that your you know, online experience is a lot safer and secure. Because obviously these security fixes have been patched. You know, these, these security vulnerabilities have been patched for a obvious reason. And I will leave a link in the description box below to these uh, security fixes if you are interested just to have a more in-depth look. Now, as mentioned in Google Chrome, um, there is not really too many features, but the main so-called new feature that we can talk about is, you know, in version 91, you know, you can now copy a file from anywhere on your computer and then paste it into an email. Because previously, you know, in Google Chrome, if you wanted to attach a file to an email, you had to drag it from the file explorer and then drop it into the email tab. And now, you know, you, know, you can simply copy and paste and that will pop it into your email for you. So that just streamlines things a little bit in version 91, especially if you are, you know, um, copying and pasting a lot into your email. And then a couple of other changes in version 91 worth mentioning is that your tab groups, you know, when they are collapsed, um, they will be frozen by Chrome automatically to free up system resources. And there are one or two exceptions to this. And that includes if your you know, a tab is playing audio and you know other types of activity. So if you are using a tab, obviously it won't you know freeze in the background, so to speak, to save resources or if you're playing audio. But if you've got a couple of tabs open and you are not using them, um, Google Chrome now will um, freeze up those tabs to you know free up system resources. And then another one worth mentioning is the HTTP port. 10080 is now blocked and this is to mitigate the NAT slipstream 2 attack. So that is also good to know. Just another security update that the port HTT port 10080 is now blocked and this is to obviously prevent the NAT slipstream 2 attack from happening. And then there's are, are, are a couple of other little um, updates basically, you know, fixes and that which will only really concern developers and um, not too many of the, those will affect your average user so um, some if you are a developer there are one or two developer updates as well so that's it chrome version 91 version 91.0.4472.77 that's what you should be on chrome version 91 started rolling out on the 25th of may 2021 I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.